Behind the leafy red brick exterior, PCS organisers say these call centres are beginning to feel like Dickensian workhouses. With workloads more than doubled, reps say support for the strike is solid. We've got something in the region of about a 98% uh, no-show. Uh, the staff are always solid. We've been gaining some momentum uh, with each uh, day strike action that we've taken. And staff who were previously allowed to um, be treated like adults had a day's work to do and could manage the, the working day at their own pace. It doesn't uh, happen with Workforce Manager because every second of the day is monitored uh, to the ridiculous degree. At this one contact centre, almost a third of the workforce has had to be transferred because of illness. Statistically, we're being asked to do over double the work that we were when uh, the, the work was defined under a benchmark. Uh, so clearly there's a statute of limitations on the speed and the pace that someone can work at uh, in the long term. And the end result of that is that if you're working in the limit full time every day, um, then work-related stress is the end result. PCS has warned of further strike action early next month if managers don't move nationally to address the union's concerns. Pete Murray, Union News at the Springbird Contact Centre in Glasgow.